Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm located in Croydon and I'm going to take a trip down into the market and I'm sure many of you have not seen Croydon market since the beginning of the pandemic since March 2020. So if you knew Croydon market is known for its multicultural heritage also the market used to be very loud and outgoing for people that used to shop here for the locals in Croydon so I'd just like to show you now how it looks in the center of the market okay so for those of you that know literally the market started here and ends right all the way down the bottom and at one stage before the pandemic you would have the market stalls coming all the way up till at least here now it's completely empty hardly anyone here You've still got this um, fresh coffee place here. Got a pub here. And it looks like they're building a high rise building here. Another one in the market. So at one stage, there was market stalls coming up here on both sides. But now, hardly anything. Look, this is the market. So I'm just going to make my way down now in the market and I'm going to show you that hardly anyone is out and at one stage you would hear people chanting for a sale but it's absolutely quiet now, I can't hear anybody Look We've got a couple stalls here selling fruit and vegetables and people are just setting up now to get ready We've got another store here but I'm telling you if you have visited Croydon Market before and you know what it's like here it's nowhere near as busy as it used to be and it's in the morning now usually at this time everybody would be out now but hardly anyone's here boss I'm just thinking no one's here the market's quiet now yeah quiet why is that it's open now is it because of the pandemic or more people, yeah? More stalls, because I was saying it's empty now. Tomorrow, tomorrow, too much shop open. Tomorrow. Is there a specific, is there a specific day? Today. That, today? Okay, cool. Yeah. So I just found out a little bit of information that the market's not so busy today, but maybe in an hour or so, things will pick up. So here's some more fruit and vegetable stores here in the market. Used to hear pound a banana, pound a banana. <laughs> Can't hear nothing anymore. Look, it's absolutely quiet. It's quite dead. Surrey Street Market is dead. Don't know why. Maybe because of the pandemic. So there is still stuff here that we'll be able to get from the locals, but it's nowhere near as busy. So I'm now coming to the end. That's how it looks, completely quiet. I'm not sure if you guys can hear it, but I have a flu, a common flu. I haven't got COVID. And I know the best thing for me to do is just boil some herbal tea. So it's only right I'm gonna show you inside this Afro-Caribbean and Asian grocery store where I can pick up a few things to boil my tea. Hello, how are you doing? You alright? I would like to get some herbal tea, any ginger and lemon. Okay. Ginger? Up here, yeah? Okay. Herbal tea. Which one is good for like cold or flu? Ginger, lemon. And these are all like the West Indian Caribbean products, right? All here? Tomatoes, ginger, okra, some noodles. Do you have any ginger and lemon? Fresh. Yeah, fresh. There's lemon. Everything's here. Even chocho, tomato, spring onion, garlic, bun. Wow. Sweet 
potato, green banana. That's proper Caribbean shop, man. Proper Caribbean shop. Yeah. I know. I need to have a little tour in here. Is that all right? Have a look around. Yeah. Thank you. Some bread, hard dough bread. Proper Caribbean shop in Croydon. Okay. Best, best shop in Croydon, right? Got your coconut milk here, tropical sun, Duns River, Grace, Maggie, which is a Jamaican brand. Um, you got your peppers here, your Duns River seasoning, tropical sun seasoning, Caribbean seasoning. Old Bay seasoning, Maggie seasoning. Oh, okay, Maggie seasoning. And Old Bay seasoning. Okay. Some juices up here as well. Syrup. I'm not really a big fan of syrup. <laughs> um, some semolina. Some more Jamaican. What's this one? Seafood seasoning. Chicken spice seasoning. Wow. So guys, just so you know, this shop is based in Croydon and they have a wide variety of Afro-Caribbean products in this shop, which I'm showing you now. They have rice also as well, Tilda Basmati. Uh, this is like the African section here. Smoked catfish. Ooh. Okay. So oil here as well. more more seasoning I'm gonna have to pick up myself a ginger because I need to boil some herbal tea right and they got some beans here as well more beans Let's have a look in the fridge section wow everything that's stocked up in here Jamaican cheese this is the shop inside, how it looks. Aki. Look here. Powder and the Jamaican Sorry, can coffee. you, what is the name of that one there? What you show me? Almonds powder and Jamaican coffee. And the biscuits, these okay, biscuits. Biscuits, that one is Colombian and this one is Jamaican. Colombian biscuits as yeah, well? That, that one, yeah. That oh, one wow. Biscuit, this one is the... Uh-huh, and Milo, they have up there as well. It's pretty good, this shop have yam as well, pumpkin. I'm gonna get myself the, the ginger cause I'm gonna boil some herbal tea. Some ginger, okra. Right, just these please. Shirley biscuits are really good, by the way. Thank you. The least cookies, they are really hard. And tasty cheese as well. It's tasty finished. cheese is finished. finished. Maybe tomorrow. But you stocked up in here. You got a good variety of stuff in this shop. Yeah. All right then. Take it easy. Have a good one. Thanks. And that's it, guys.